Hello friends, welcome back. Today we're going to use a mix-in to add common behavior between unrelated objects. As you've seen, behavior is shared through inheritance. However, there are cases when inheritance is not the best solution. Inheritance does not work well for unrelated objects like bird and airplane. They can both fly, but a bird is not a type of airplane and vice versa. The, uh, for unrelated objects, it's better to use mix-ins. A mix-in allows other objects to use a collection of functions. So let's say let fly mixin is equal to a function where we pass in an object and then we go object.fly and we say console fly in whoosh. The fly mixin makes any object that gives, um, takes any object and gives it the fly method. Uh, so here we uh, have set the bird equal to an object with the name of Donald and it's got two legs. So, and then a plane is a model and it has a number of passengers. So uh, fly, mixin, bird, and fly, mixin, plane. And so we're passing in the objects and giving the object the capacity uh, to execute this function. Um, so cool, so the fly mixin just ma makes it kind of easy to write that. Um, and both bird and plane can fly even though they're not really related um, in terms of their, the purpose of them, of why they would exist in a program. So note how the mixin allows for the same fly method to be reused on unrelated objects, bird and plane. Create a mixin named um, glide mixin that defines the method named glide. Then use the glide mixin to give both bird and boat the ability to glide. Okay, cool. So first off we want to say um, console.log, let's say boat.glide. And we want to make that a function. And let's do that for um, not just boat, but we want to do it for bird as well. So both bird and boat should glide, but however, neither of them have the capacity to glide because we haven't added that as a thing. So instead of getting a type error, we want this to say, um, uh, just, we're just, it doesn't look like that we need it to say anything specifically. So we're going to say, let the uh, glide uh, mix in. Is that right? Glide mixin. Let that equal a function. Function where we pass in an object. And then we say object dot uh, glide is equal to a function. And that function be console dot log uh, gliding. Uh, we glide G L I D. Okay, now something's not working. Object .fly, object. Oh, and now what we need to do is add. So we just need to say um, glide mixin. So yeah, glide mixin, and then we're going to pass in the uh, bird object. So now we've got gliding. We. So what was happening before we did this? This is function. That this is just a function that sets this up. Um, and then, uh, so what we need to do is actually call this function. So right now, the bird has no glide function, right? And so what we need to do is add it. So to do that, we're going to pass the bird object into the glide mixin. And so the bird becomes this one. And so bird.glide, so we're going bird.glide is equal to a function of this. And so we're adding, so onto the bird object, let's console.log bird. Um, no, that won't work. Okay, so right now the bird is this object, right? But this object has these um, elements, but we're adding the glide onto it. And now if we were to console.log bird here, um, we would see that glide has a function on it. So we've, we've used this mixin, which is just basically a function to make this work, um, to uh, generate the glide. And so we've done, done it to bird, and now we need to do it to boat. So glide mixin for boat, and now the boat will glide as well. Name, name. So yeah, you could also go I'm uh, this dot name, and, and I'm gliding. 
Wee. I'm Donald and I'm I'm gliding. We actually don't need to console log these because the console log is in here. So we can get rid of this. And then we won't get the undefined. So I'm a Donald and I'm gliding because we've got a bird called Donald and then the boat is called Warrior. I'm Warrior and I'm gliding. We, they're both doing it, but they're both related to there. But we're both adding this glide function to them via these guys right here. And I think if we were to run the test, that would pass. Um, great, I think that that pretty much uh, describes that pretty well. The mixin just takes an object. Oh, another thing I'd wanna do is I don't like defining things like this. I like to do it like uh, function called uh, glide mixin is equal to this guy. And uh, this is just the way I like to write. Um, I guess you've got to do it there. I like to write functions this way because it makes them more more clear to me. Um, so I would have I would have wrote this like this. Um, it's hard to get out of doing it like that. But you could go object dot glide is equal to. I guess you've got to write it this way for this one. I wouldn't know how to turn it around. Anyways, uh, this was just semantics. This is just the way that I like to look at code. Anybody, you can make your own decision based on that. And we run the test and they pass. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. We'll see you in the next lesson.